Hi, good morning, everyone, and I hope that everybody had a fantastic weekend. I got Lily here with me today, and I hope everybody is ready for a brand new week of school and learning. Okay, I do have a word of the day I'd like to share with everyone, and today's word of the day is deem. Deem is a verb. Deem means to come, to think, or judge, or to consider, or to have an opinion. The covered bridge was closed to automobile traffic for the winter because town officials deemed it too hazardous to motorists. So that is your an, an opinion or thought or judge of something. And my thought of the day is everything is hard before it is easy. So you have to work hard for things before it can become easy. And that is for everything in life. Okay, so we celebrated Earth Day on Friday. And this is a picture from Ms. Borman's class. I know we shared Ms. Torres' class. Um, and this is a picture of they were picking up trash around the school. So thank you so much for doing that. And I know that Ms. Castro's fifth grade class, they did a lot of things for Earth Day and I know they made some posters. So great job celebrating the Earth and Earth Day, everyone. Don't forget April's um, April's almost over. So we're coming to the end of our honesty and integrity challenge. So please make sure you're making your collages of everything dealing with honesty and integrity. If you need more information about this, please just send me an email and let me know. Okay, FSA Spirit Week for fourth and fifth graders. Um, today, it's Dress Up as Your Favorite Rock Star, wear your favorite band t-shirt. Tomorrow, it's Round Up High Scores, dressed in your best Western outfits. On Wednesday, it's Go for the Gold, dress up as your favorite athlete and arrive for success. On Thursday, Don't Sweat the Test, wear your sweatpants, relax, and ace the test. And on Friday, it is we're sharing with Autism Awareness Month. It is Share Your Passion Day. So on Friday, everybody wear something that shows your passion. That is for everybody on Friday. Um, so keep that in mind. Okay, I have some really special chess news. 
A special shout out to Ms. Iacone and her co-coaches, Ms. Castro and Ms. Para, for leading our first time chess club to a successful event. On Saturday, the chess club participated in the District K-12 Championship as part of the Chess Think Initiative. The students participated in five rounds of chess tournaments. At the award ceremony, they were awarded the following awards. First place individual fourth grade student district wide Violetta. Um, I am so sorry, Violetta. I'm going to mispronounce your name. So I apologize. Podobolaski. Um, and two students were recognized for their outstanding week to week participation in the online chess to think initiative grand P chess championship Violetta again great job and Siddharth Hirano. Aventure Waterways second third grade group earned third place as top performing group remember this is the district. And Aventura Waterways fourth through fifth grade earned third place as top performing group that is amazing great job. Uh, those of you that joined the chess club on Saturday were related with all the awards for being a first year chess club. And I am seriously, and I know everybody else too, is very proud of you guys. That is an awesome accomplishment. Once so again, thank you, Ms. Icon, for taking a leap and helping us to form the club. And a special thank you to Ms. Castro and Ms. Para for their continuous support and assistance. So way to go, chess club. That is amazing. Great job. Okay, so I hope that everybody is getting ready for testing next week. Um, we're at full force ahead. Um, so I know that everybody is going to do a fantastic job. Uh, remember, there is no more checking out of books that is closed. Uh, we're going to be doing uh, inventory in both the with the library books and the laptops. Uh, so that is going to be starting. Thank you for watching WEXP News. Have fun exploring today and have a great day, everyone.